In this video, I'm going to show you how you can export models like this from Blender into Roblox Studio. This is going to be quick and easy, and this is literally going to be how to get a single model from Blender to Roblox Studio. And if you have a texture applied, that will work too. But make sure the texture is applied in Blender. So if it isn't, make sure you select your model, go over here to this little checkered ball, and then do new. Base color, change it to image texture, and then add your um, image here in the open button. So for example here, you can see I've got like the text white and the, the red red. But don't worry if you want to just color this in studio, you can. But let's get started here. So what we're going to do is we are going to do file in Blender, export, and then FBX. FBX is the best format for exporting. So now what you want to do is um, you can see I've got subscribe button dot FBX. Just click on export FBX, click on it, and there we go. That is now exporting. That's it for Blender. That's all you need to do. If you do want this in different parts, you will have to export it in different parts. But if you need this in like multiple parts, so for example, you want the, the text to be separate so you can color it in studio, check out the video that's on screen now. I'll link it in the description. Check that video out if you want to know how to export it in multiple parts, because that will go through step by step how to do it. However, the way we're doing it right now will work usually. So now we've come over to Roblox Studio and we are going to add a mesh part. So come up here to workspace click the little plus and then type mesh part as you see you'll add like this little mesh part here and this is what we're going to use we are going to now go to the properties on the mesh part so you can see in the bottom corner there is the mesh id and a little folder click on that little folder as you see here today i have the subscribe button so click on that open and here it will say the meshes you're importing is very large. We'd like to resize the mesh. I am going to say yes and location data, sure. And now, as you can see, I have it here inside of Studio. If you can't see it, just click on it in your Explorer here. If you click on this in Explorer and then press F on your keyboard, it will take you to it. But yeah, that is how you can import models from, from Blender into Studio. Please do leave a like and subscribe if you found it helpful. Click the video on screen right now if you want to learn how to make a traffic cone accessory for Roblox. But anyway, hopefully I'll see you in the next video.